Caroline Faraday is in Hollywood for us now and lots of success for people from the South East, Caroline. Absolutely. You might even be surprised by how well the South East was represented. I'll take you through all of our connections to the Oscars in just a moment because, as you rightly said, Rob, Adele was the big winner, Brighton's Adele, representing the South East, an absolutely sort of star of the show last night. She scooped uh, an Oscar for her song, Skyfall. The sky Even for a music star as big as Adele, she acknowledged this moment is a once in a lifetime. Thank you so much. Thank you. This is amazing. Um, oh, I'd just like to thank Barbara Broccoli and Michael Wilson at Eon Productions, Sony Pictures, MGM, Paul Etworth for, um, oh God, <laughs> Mate, believing in me all the time. And my man, I love you, baby. <laughs> With a global audience close to a billion, the Academy Awards are the most prestigious award ceremony in the world, given out in a room full of the biggest stars on the planet. Performing the song she wrote for the Bond movie Skyfall, she was joined on stage by other Bond legends, including Shirley Bassey. Adele Atkins has won 104 awards already, including numerous Brit Awards, Grammys, Ivor Novellos and a Golden Globe Award for Skyfall earlier this year. Her mantelpiece was probably already straining under the weight. Two hit albums, 19 and 21, shot her to fame both in the UK and in the United States. You can't switch on the radio for 10 minutes without hearing one of her songs. All this, and she's not yet 25 years old. One can only wonder what's next for Adele to conquer. It's the first time, actually, that a Bond theme has uh, won anything at the Oscars, and apparently it took Adele Ad Adkins and Paul Epworth ten minutes to write the Skyfall theme. It's incredible, isn't it? A little bit longer than that to record it and lay it down, but ten minutes to write the song. Now, as I mentioned earlier, it isn't the only connection to the South East. Naomi Watts, who was nominated in the Best Actress category, she um, actually grew up in Shoreham in Kent. So she uh, uh, was there last night. She nominated, she didn't win. She lost out to Anne Hathaway, unfortunately. And 10-year-old Isabella Allen, who you may remember we mentioned on the programme, she's from East Dean, near Eastbourne. She played the young Cosette in Les Mis. And Les Mis, well, you might think to yourself, oh, all the action took place in France. It didn't. Much of it was recorded at the historic dockyard in Chatham, and they uh, cast extras from the area as well. So it's really exciting to see so much of the Southeast talent represented here at the Oscars.